Welcome to the Commercial UAV Expo in Las Vegas. Today, we've managed to come up with a few DJ and users at the event to learn more about their key takeaways of the event, as well as how they manage to integrate DJI drones to their daily work to make everything safer and more efficient. Let's find out more together. You know, the, the thing that always amazes me when we go to these trade shows is the number of companies that we never really hear about that we see at these companies that are doing a, a ton of different things. We always hear about manufacturers like DJI and, and the, the big manufacturers, but we don't see the small companies that do software or that do like one payload or that have like very specific software or LiDAR or all these. So it's really cool to see here and, and, and come and see everybody in one location. DJI started out with consumer products and had no enterprise line until those of us in public safety started taking those consumer products and, and finding ways to fit them into an enterprise type of work. So as we took those consumer drones and made them fit our needs, DJI started to realize that they needed to develop better tools for us and, and support us, and it was really great. And now we've started to see a little bit of a shift in the other direction where now public safety customers are taking consumer drones and utilizing them in unique ways for public safety roles. Um, DJI, hands down, makes a uh, quality, reliable product, and that's really why we've embraced uh, DJI as the main component of our workflows for our customers when it comes to drones. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot of systems on the market that are very difficult to work with, and DJI just has the best user experience. Um, we've had a lot of success with the L1 program. It's allowed a lot of our customers to embrace uh, doing LiDAR mapping with aircraft that have never been able to do that before. Um, LiDAR applications are definitely starting to take off. Um, LiDAR has been slower to catch up uh, compared to like photogrammetry applications, but LiDAR sensors and data has become a lot more accessible than it has in years past. And for companies that have been waiting for much more affordable LiDAR applications, sensors, software technology to support it, uh, there's definitely a lot more opportunity in the, the commercial drone market than just taking standard photos. Well, we heavily rely on the enterprise line that DJI offers, particularly the uh, M300. Uh, we fly the H20T and the H20N, uh, but the M30T is kind of our workhorse, our go-to. That's the first one we're pulling out of our uh, assets just because it is so quick to deploy. It has so many func uh, functionalities. Um, it has the zoom lens, it has a thermal camera, it has the laser rangefinder, and uh, in addition to that, we can uh, put some attachments on top from CZI, some spotlights on top that really light up the mountainside for us to not only uh, give the uh, light up the scene, but also to provide that uh, ambient light to our patients as they're hiking down. It works when you need it to work. It can fly in rain. It can fly in snow. It can fly at high altitudes. It has the range and the endurance that we need. Um, quite frankly, I have actual names of real human beings that if I wasn't deploying a DJI product in that scenario, these people probably would not have made it. They probably would have expired on the mountainside. The DJI products, the enterprise lineup allows us to get the drone up in the air and able to find our patients quickly and efficiently. Thanks everyone for watching. So that's a wrap for Commercial UAV Expo. If you have any questions, please drop them in the comment section we'll be sure to come back to you. Thanks again for watching.